Alright, just so you know, our slides are not on our set, so uh, please click them below. Alright, uh, my name is Jonathan Adams. I'm Jen Dover, we're from Logics Incorporated. Going green and saving energy, it means a lot of things to different people. It's our vision to share with you how to do both, with smarter power. With the coming removal of rate caps and the big energy companies uh, backing down on renewable energy production, we as consumers of electricity and energy are going to be paying more for it, financially and ecologically. That's okay, because according to TV and the hype on the web, Google, IBM, nation's electric companies have a solution, the smart grid. The smart grid is the power, is the, uh, power industry solution for better managing the electrical power grid. Right now, the electrical grid is just a big open loop. Consumers consume, and the electric companies do their best to meet the demand. It's a juggling act of uh, turning on and turning off coal plants. And if that balancing act goes away, we get burnouts. The existing solution for meeting rising peak demand has been to build more plants, but legislation is changing that and stopping the building of new coal plants. To manage peak loads, the electric companies are going to have to close the uh, electri electricity consumption loop. <laughs> so closing the loop, what does that mean? Well, that means the energy companies need to limit the consumer's demand for electricity. That means they want to take control of electrical devices in your home and limit your consumption. Because without control, there is no conservation. Suddenly this is a complex solution with a lot of unanswered questions. Big brother privacy issues? Who fronts the bill for the new smart grids? What are the savings for the consumer if they choose to opt into the system? What, how, and where do the utilities exercise control? <laughs> well, the, well, the solution is made even more complex by competing technologies and the perceived high cost of home automation. On top of that, electric companies can't decide on the best approach for connecting the consumer's home with the electric grid. So if the goal of the smart grid is only to manage consumer demand for electricity at peak times, and if home control and monitoring is the answer, then why should we as consumers wait for the energy companies? Particularly when the energy companies are not about reducing overall energy consumption. Remember, they only make money when we consume. And this is what drives us as developers. We believe that providing the consumer with products that are affordable and allow them to save their energy and their money, then we can do a lot to reduce energy consumption, independent of the electric companies, the smart grid, and policy change. And this is what we mean by smarter power. So if we as consumers want to save energy and money, where do we focus our efforts? 45% of your electricity bill comes from um, heating and cooling. If we use the many computers in our thermostats to maximize energy conservation, most of them have programs to do that. Uh, but the problem is, is that within one year, 70% of households stop using the smart functions in their thermostats. Uh, they either forget how, or they find that the schedule doesn't meet their immediate comfort demands, and they turn them off and just randomly set them, Another never to return again. Oh, anyway. Another prime location is your home media center. Most home entertainment centers have at least four devices that are either always on, uh, network aware, or in sleep mode, which means they're still consuming power even when they're off. Uh, so, well, while most automated solutions for reducing energy are often complicated and don't focus on three key factors for energy production, uh, basically control of HVAC at all times, monitoring and minimizing parasitic power, and informing the user about their energy consumption for their devices. We're trying to make it easy and affordable to do all three. We work alongside with major manufacturers and utilize a 900 megahertz wireless networking solution for home automation. We develop these devices to empower the homeowner to not only control their home, but accurately monitor the power usage that all of your devices are connected to. So this means saving energy is as simple as hitting a button on your way out the door. Uh, it wirelessly connects. It allows your devices to be automatically shut down when you leave the home, setting your, th your thermostat into energy save mode, shutting down PCs, and cutting off all parasitic power. When you come back home, you press that button, all the power returns to your devices. And um, you can see that the energy charts and graphs um, show you what your devices are using so that you can easily manipulate what's using too much power versus what isn't. Uh, because we believe that when you save energy, you're also saving money, but you need to inform the user of their energy savings and where their energy is going. Uh, and better yet, though, our solutions don't involve rewiring your home. It's as simple as just uh, plug, play, and save. We believe that wireless, wireless technology allows everyone to have access to energy conservation tools that are simple, cost-effective, and help people make smart choices about using power. Smart grids may or may not end up helping you save money, but we think this one can. 
So thank you. Uh, contact us if you feel free. We're always happy to talk with people about our solutions. Uh, these are real solutions, though. We are under a lot of NDAs, but feel free to talk to us. Thank you.